Hey guys, um, this is really serious today. Uh, it's nothing about like X Factor or anything like that. Um, in Oakland, a couple of days ago, there was a shooting, and I live about, I want to say, 30 minutes away. And it's really difficult because when you hear that, you know, there's a shooting in Oakland, you kind of shrug it off, and you really don't want to deal with it. Because, hey, it's Oakland, you know, yada, 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 it always happens. This time, mm -mm. there was a one-year-old who was shot in the head. And um, if you recall that there was also a shooting and a three-year-old had passed away uh, just a little while ago, earlier this year, uh, it's, it's getting to the point, it's just like, you don't know what to do. You don't know how you can help, but for me when I saw that video that was on, um, that they've been airing, uh, from the surveillance, uh, I want to ask people, can you guys do the same thing? Can you break the no snitching rule? Can you guys say what's going on and explain to people, look, you know, this is exactly what's happening. This is what's going on in Oakland and we need to stop this. Whether or not that we live in the city, you need to stop this. We don't need Oakland to have any more shootings. We don't need Oakland. We don't need these people to have guns in their hands to just have vengeance on anybody they choose. Um, you know, and it's just getting ridiculous. And we need to ask the public. It's like, you guys were all out there. You guys were shooting a music video. You guys can do something about this. A one-year-old is on the verge of dying because you guys sat there and you guys shot him up. And if you're watching this, Turn yourselves in, you know. Hopefully he lives. You guys shut up eight people. You guys hurt them. And whether it's gang related or not, it shouldn't matter. You guys need to turn yourselves in. And you guys need to do something about this now. Because this is getting ridiculous. And you guys are involving children. And these children need to live. These children need to have lives. They didn't even... The, the child had no life ahead of him after you guys shot him. And he was only three years old. And now this child is only, you know, one years old. He's just a couple, a month or so away from his two-year birthday. I mean, why, why did you do that? Why? What was the purpose of shooting up, you know, a place that was actually, you know, doing something good? They were, you know, shooting a music video. They were showing their own own way of actually like doing something good they were making music music is life but you guys with your guns had provided death and if you continue to do this Oakland will become one of the worst cities as it already is you know to live in with gang violence and guns um, you know just like Detroit just like LA you know it's getting worse and worse and I'm tired of hearing about shootings, um, you know, so is there something that we can do about it? I hope so. If we can stop the shootings, if we can stop, you know, these gangs, you know, from shooting just random people. I mean, you guys just shot in a huge crowd of people for no reason. What was the reasoning behind it? So um, that's what I wanted to rant about today. Uh, you know, let me know what you think and what we can do. And, you know, if you have any suggestions on telling these people what to do, you know, tell them to come forward. Do a rent yourself. I would really appreciate it. Um, you know, like they said, $5,000 is up there for grabs for people who come across, you know, one of the shooters. So, if you get the suspect... Say something. Because if imagine if it was your kid. Imagine if it was you. Wouldn't you like somebody to say something? You know? So. I'm out. Just think about it.